Hello, welcome back. This is Crazy Bat Lady. I want to show you how to get this lumen stone that's trapped behind a gate. And it has nothing to do with anything that you can grab in the area, such as this letter. There's actually no way to unlock this door, but I'm going to show you how to get in there. It's going to involve a side quest and also going and robbing some treasure hoarders right here. Go right here on the map and go up to the second tent. And they're going to have a map hanging on the pillar there. You can kill them if you want, but completely up to you. There are some chests here or you can just take the map and run. However, there is one other thing you have to do, and it's not that spot. Um, you have to go over here to this teleporter and just follow where my character is going. And you're gonna have to beat up some more treasure hoarders. Trust me, it's gonna be a whole thing. There's gonna, there's gonna be a lot of beating up treasure hoarders. All right, so once you're done with them, they freak out and they want you to do a side quest for them. You accept because, I mean, you accept. <laughs> and now you wanna go up here where the waypoint is and talk to Yanbo again, who is their leader. And he's going to want you to go and raid some other places. Or I guess they're like the Millilith or something. I don't know. It confused the hell out of me if I'm being completely honest. So you head over to this camp and just, you know, trash it, steal all their stuff pillage, whatever. Um, and then you go and do the same thing to the second camp that's marked. Nothing of note here. Um, after you do that, you're going to be prompted to go to a third camp to once again murder treasure hoarders. However, this time there's a very important item that you will need to pick up. And do keep in mind that there are going to be a lot of enemies here, so be prepared. It's going to be like a few waves of different types of enemies, including Fatui's. So just keep that in mind. Okay, just going to knock out this wave real quick. And then I'm going to go grab the item that you want to grab. Okay, so right back here on this bag is the other part of the treasure map, like the one that you grabbed on the pillar earlier. That's the second half. So finish killing all the enemies and the Middlelith or the treasure hoarders. I don't even know anymore who they are. Tell you good job. You get an achievement and you get some primo gems, uh, a precious chest, pretty sweet deal, but that's not all. Now you can go, oh, you also get the Cup of Commons, which will come in handy because there's a certain NBC looking for that type of stuff. Now, the next place that you will want to go is right here to this teleporter. Now that you have done that quest and you have those maps and you're going to want to head this way. Follow my lead. And this is going to be how you get inside of that room. Right, jump up here. And once you're at this camp, you guessed it, more treasure hoarders. So just take them out. It's just, you know, a couple of low level trash ads. So shouldn't be too bad. Once you got them, uh, if you set this little bomb on fire, it'll burn the rug, revealing a trap door. I don't think you have to burn the rug to reveal it, but here it is. You go and enter the trap door and 
here you are, inside of the room, with another achievement as well. So there's going to be two pretty juicy chests, and of course, the Lumen Stone that you're looking for. Maybe your last one. Maybe just one you're trying to get. But I really hope that this helped you out. Um, please consider leaving a like and subscribe. Uh, more Chasm videos coming very soon. Um, and thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.